Yeah, what up, boxing fans? I just saw the uh, article from FightHype.com where Floyd Mayweather tells Amir Khan, he says, make $300 million, then me and you can talk about fighting. So, let's get into this article. Um, he made $300 million fight Manny Pacquiao, as we all know. The pay-per-view sold about $4.6 million, had $4.6 million buys. But you do realize, Floyd Mayweather, that you only made $300 million because of Manny Pacquiao, none of your none of your other fights ever grossed three hundred million dollars. So Manny Pacquiao helped you make that money. Now you say Amir Khan need to make three hundred million dollars before he can talk to you. Well, you fought Marcos Maidana twice, a guy who Amir Khan beat, and Marcos Maidana never made three hundred million dollars, and you fought him twice. You fought Andre Berto. Amir Khan's sparring partner to duck Amir Khan, Andre Berto never made $3 million, $300 million. In fact, the $4 million he made against you was his highest payday ever. So the $300 million comment seemed like another duck tactic, man. Like you've used your whole career to, to avoid Amir Khan and duck Amir Khan. Now you put this other hurdle up. Make three million, three, make three hundred million dollars, then we can talk. So if Amir Khan don't see this as a duck duck tactic. I don't know what he's gonna see it as, but it's another duck tactic and another hurdle that he's putting up. And he went on to say, um, to explain what happened with the with the uh, fight at the Guerrero Garcia fight. He said, you know, no hard feelings, no disrespect. I just took a couple jabs at him to let him know there's only one king. That's all it was, basically. Nothing really more than that, stated Floyd Mayweather. So he's just talking about their encounter that they had at the Garcia Guerrero fight, where they exchanged a few words or whatever. But we know Floyd, that fight is never going to happen. We all know that Amir Khan's reach, his speed will give you problems. That's why you never took the fight, and that's why you never will take the fight. So you can make all these excuses about Khan need to make $300 million dollars. For before y'all can fight, we all know what it is, man. The real boxing fans, we all know why you avoided Amir Khan. We all know why you never fought Amir Khan. We know why you fought Marcos Maidana twice, man. And we know why you chose Andre Berto for your last fight. You ain't fooling nobody but yourself. And these Flomo Floyd Mayweather fans, these the only people you got. And you ain't even fooling them because they know what the deal is. They already know. That you avoided Amir Khan and you ducked him. They they won't admit it, but they already know. And the casual and the hardcore boxing fans knows what's going on. So enjoy your money. Enjoy your $300 million you that Pacquiao helped you make. Oh, you made that money off the back of Manny Pacquiao. Pa Manny Pacquiao made you $300 million Because without Manny Pacquiao, you would have never seen $300 million. You would have never sold... 4.6 million pay-per-view buys because you only sold when it was when, it, when you was on your own without Manny Pacquiao you sold 400,000 pay-per-view buys with Andre Berto and that's according to Yahoo Sports and I believe Yahoo Sports so without your own on your own you ain't making shit you selling 400,000 pay-per-view buys on your own with Manny Pacquiao, you're only making money because of Manny Pacquiao. Manny Pacquiao was the hand that feeds you. You only made that money because of Manny Pac-Man Pacquiao. So you know your role and, st and play your position. And wait on Pacquiao to give you another payday. Because you ain't never making that kind of money again. Unless you fight Manny Pac-Man Pacquiao. And you remember that. The only reason you made $300 million was because of Manny Pacquiao. Not because of you, because of Manny Pacquiao. 